and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. That was a really awkward wink. Sorry. <laughs> I used to take myself out on dates. Open my own damn doors, pay for everything. Woo. On my Hello. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the first Princess Polly haul of 2022. I am super excited. Is this, how many years have I been working with Princess Polly at this point? I think my first video with them was in 2017. It was either 2017 or 2018, so it has been a while. I'm always so excited to work with Princess Polly. They just have the best stuff. And literally most of my wardrobe is Princess Polly. Like for example, this dress is probably my most worn item of all time because it's just so comfy. It looks really great. I always get questions when I wear it. Please bring this out in more colors. I think there's black and there's like a terracotta color, sage green, like every single color and I will buy all of them. So I'm going to show you guys some bits and bobs that I picked up from Princess Polly. We are moving into winter slowly but surely. It's slowly getting cooler. Oh, Charlie's sleeping on the shoe. Oh. My new discount code with Princess Polly is Connor20 and that'll get you 20% off the website. I can't believe it's nearly April. We just had Christmas. Firstly, I realized that I really love wearing oversized tees. So I wanted to get some more because Princess Polly honestly have the best ones. I also love wearing them to the gym. And what I do is I tuck the back of them into my sports bra or my bra. So that way it kind of has that oversized look, but it doesn't, you can still show off some shape, you know? So firstly, I have this big pink oversized tee. I love color, especially when it comes to oversized tees. So this one is, what does it even say? Chaotic Generation, something like that. This is in a small slash medium. This one is huge. I could definitely wear this as a t-shirt dress or as a shirt to bed, honestly. I love a big oversized tee as pajamas. Super, super cute. Every time I wear like a graphic tee with a gym fit, I always get questions. And nine times out of 10, it's a Princess Polly. Let's do all the graphic tees first, shall we? This one I love because of the color. What does it say? I love shirts or jumpers that are kind of like made to look as though, how do I explain this? As if it's a part of like a sports team or I don't know. So this one just says sportive and relax co. Established 96, this just says play the game. It's just cute. I just really liked the color and I wanted something a little bit more plain in a darker color. This is in a size 12, an Australian size 12. And it's oversized, but it's not enormous so this one is like perfect to wear to the gym and then this shirt i actually have already in a lighter color and i wear it all the time this one is in an australian size 10 i just love the color the pretty baby blue blue and green at the moment as i'm sure you're aware because i've repeated it and i wear it all the time it looks really nice with my hair at the moment which is interesting like styling clothes and stuff because for so long i was blonde and then I was brown and now I'm like really dark brown. So just going through a lot of different hair things right now. Wow, I really did get a lot of shirts. <laughs> I have two more. I think I wore this in my last vlog. I saw it and I thought, oh, that'll be a cute pajama shirt or just a cute shirt in general. This one is a Powerpuff Girls shirt. Again, this one's super oversized, but I just love the tie dye. I have another shirt that kind of looks like this. Um, so I love the tie dye and I just love like the old school cartoon shirts. They just all look really fun. And then this one I've worn to the gym already. So I think this is a bit sweaty, <laughs> but I really like this one because of how it's kind of, what's the word? What's the word? Heathered? No, it's a bit grainy and, and it looks as though it's been worn a heap, but it has Britney Spears on the front and it says, Britney, I'm a slave for you. <laughs> And she's just on there. And I don't know, I just really liked the colors. This one is in a small slash medium. So really cool, love that oversized tee. Okay, changing pace a little bit. I know that like, what are they called? Dunks? Those shoes that are really popular right now and very hard to get. I definitely need to get some more white sneakers. I was a little bit hesitant to see what these would look like because they are a more higher top shoe. I have worn these so they're a little bit dirty, but these are brilliant for squatting at the gym actually because of the stability and how they're a little bit higher of an ankle and they're nice and flat. And I think these are a little bit platform. It's hard for me to tell nowadays because literally every single pair of shoes 
I own a platform <laughs> because I just can't wear regular shoes. I need a little bit of extra height. But I love these. Super, super comfy. They look really cool with oversized jeans as well, which I really, really love. And they look really cool with these jeans, if I can find them. I am obsessed with. Jeans is always hard to find ones that fit your waist and aren't too tight on your legs. Or, you know, the crotch isn't too long. I'm just trying to get this off. These ones, I made sure I looked at the reviews. Whenever it comes to pants or anything that's not like a t-shirt per se, but honestly, I pretty much look at the reviews for everything that I get because it's really helpful for sizing. So these ones I got in a size four and I would never normally get jeans in a size four. I'd probably go for more of like an eight or a six, but all the reviews said to size down. So I got a four and I'm very glad I did because they are very oversized. Super, super baggy, but they fit me really nicely around my waist. I love the little brown denim thing on the back there. Very, very cute. And they're just like a very nice, this is probably my favorite wash of jean where it's kind of like that medium blue. And then they are pretty long, but what's new? <laughs> but the model I think had them rolled up in like really like wide rolls, but I'm probably gonna cut these. I cut most of my jeans, super easy because they look the same because it's frayed anyway but I roll them up and I think they look cool like flowing over the white sneakers I wore these when I went to Ikea the other week but I'm obsessed I can't wait for it to get a little bit cooler because I can wear jeans more often I just I love so yeah if you're looking for a nice slouchy comfy pair of jeans go for these but make sure you size down okay this ow I just cut my thumb <laughs> this I know I'm gonna get so much wear out of when it gets a little bit cooler. I always get really excited in the mornings when it's kind of cold and I'm like, oh my God, I get to put on a jumper for like 10 minutes. I just love it. This is just a very, very plain zip up hoodie. Super, super simple, but it's like fleecy on the inside. This is in a size eight. It's kind of oversized, but it's not like enormous. I mean, honestly, I don't think I buy anything that actually fits me when it comes to the top, unless it's like a crop top, but it just has a little hood. Please tell me I haven't got this dirty. But I just really like the material. It's so simple. I love pieces like this because I can pair it with literally anything and it's gonna go. It just looks really cool. I can envision myself pairing it with like crop jeans and then like white sneakers or something. I don't know. I just really, really love the simple gray hoodie and I'll probably be wearing this to the gym in the mornings a lot. So yeah, and it just has the silver buckle at the front and it has pockets, which is very important. <laughs> Okay, this, I'm super excited because whenever it's the nighttime, I'm definitely a leather jacket girl. I have this cropped leather jacket that I pretty much pair with everything that I wear on a night out, but sometimes I don't wanna wear black. So I saw this and I thought, oh, you are quite gorgeous. So what size should I get this in? This isn't an extra small slash small. I probably could have gone with a small slash medium or whatever the next size is up just cause it's quite, it is quite fitted on my arms, but I still think it fits fine. It's just a matter of like how you like your like jackets to fit. So this is a long or like full length jacket in a really pretty brown color. So when I don't want to wear black or if I'm on a night out or something, it's not going to ruin the outfit because like, for example, going out and then wearing like that gray jumper, it just wouldn't like work with like a nicer fit. Whereas this is like a really pretty jacket, which I love. And I think I'm gonna get so much wear out of it. I love that like leather look. I think it's so classy, very nighttime, and it just like elevates an outfit without actually doing anything. I could totally pair this with like big chunky black boots and like a short mini skirt and a crop. Chuck this over the top and it's like, oh, I can see it now. Okay, lastly, I've been wearing this hat all the time. It just has Yosemite on it, Sierra, Nevada, California. I don't know if that's how you say it, but I love this. I think it's so cute. I believe this is called a dad hat because I don't like baseball caps, but I also don't really know the difference. <laughs> All I know is some hats look ridiculous on me because they have too much coverage. I like these ones that are like less coverage, if that makes any sense at all. Just really nice because it is like a neutral, very light color with the brown. It goes with everything. Whereas like I have a lot of hats that are like pink and blue and it's not necessarily going to go with everything. But I've been back on wearing hats to the gym a lot because my hair is so much shorter and my friend is a bit shorter. So I just, it's so much easier to just go and chuck this on the top. So I really, really love this. Princess Polly have really cool hats. I also need to pick up some new sunnies because 
I've managed to lose all of mine. I think that is everything. I'm trying to think if I forgot anything. I just remember getting a lot of t-shirts this time around. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this first little Princess Polly haul of the year. Again, you can use the code... Ooh. Again, you can use the code Connor20 and that'll get you 20% off Princess Polly. Everything is always listed... <laughs> Everything is always listed in the description box down below. And as always, I hope you're having a lovely day or night to wherever you are in the world. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye. That was a really awkward wink. Sorry. <laughs>